win number two here at Virginia Rose Speedway, fifth overall win on the season. Congratulations. Thank you. This uh, Virginia's been really, really good to us. We've been here three times. We've won twice, and I think fourth the other time. So this place is a beautiful facility. You know, we go all over the country, and this place is one of the nicest places we come. And it's good to run good. Good, you know, it makes us feel really good to come here and be able to run well at a, at a nice place like this. And Jason opened up a little lead early. Did you just have to be a little patient and, and wait for it to come to you? Uh, yeah, when we started out a little bit loose, I needed the fuel load to come off a little bit. I mean, not necessarily loose, but hard to steer. Let the fuel load come off and get the wing back, and that thing was beautiful through the center of the race. They won five times now on the year, been in the top ten almost every single night, it seems like. Do you feel like the consistency is there right now? Absolutely. You know, these guys, they worked hard all winter. Uh, we lost our consistency there for a few weeks. We were trying some things, and, and uh, we threw that stuff out the window a couple of nights ago. So happy to say we're back to normal and uh, running well, and I think we're going to stick with this for the rest of the year. Yeah, I know it's still early in the year, but are wins the thing you focus on now and not worry about the points? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, right now it's not about the point lead. The point lead is, is that's October, November, or, or September, somewhere around that. Right now, win races, finish race. Finish races first and win as many as you can. And if we can do that, we can keep doing that the way we're doing it. I think we'll have a good shot at the title finally. How cool is it to be in victory lane with your daughter? It's awesome. That's one of the things, you know, when you first have your daughter, you feel like an idiot the first couple of times you forget to hug her when she comes down there. But that's the neatest thing in the world right now because, uh, you know, even a night on a bad night, you get in the motorhome and she tells you good job. So to be down there in victory lane with both my daughter, my wife, and my daughter-to-be is, uh, is pretty exciting. Joey, another strong run here at Virginia Denali coming on second. Yeah, it was a great run. We uh, This type of track definitely isn't my style of racing, and uh, I need to get a lot better at it. And being in between Jason Myers and Donnie Schatz is probably the two best finesse guys out here. I definitely think we're getting better, and and um, I'll take it and go on to the next race. As long as we keep running consistently like this and learning from what's going on on the racetrack, it should be fine. And went all 30 laps nonstop. Was that a little bit surprising tonight? Um, yes and no. I mean, it's... These guys, it's the world of outlaws. They're supposed to be the best drivers on dirt. So we should be able to do that for the fans and run 30 laps without a crash or something crazy going on. But you never know. In this style of racing, anything can happen. But um, I'm kind of glad it didn't because I went running second. I would have hated lining up on the outside. I'm sure Jason was definitely going to go to the to the bottom. And, and uh, the guy probably running third would have been looking pretty good on the guy on the outside. So... Um, I'm glad it finished the way it is. We can look at our notes and try and get better for the next race. Hey, Gator, great race this weekend, three top five, taking a points lead. Does that boost the team's confidence? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think my biggest problem is, you know, I've been saying DNFs, you can't have DNFs, and, and I never, I guess, looked at myself, and I think the, the whole deal bulls got me breaking my hand. Um, not that it was my fault, but it is my fault, and I should have just been more patient and settled in and got what I could get. And that's why we're in a position we are right now. We would be doing a lot better in the points, and um, and you just got to learn from your mistakes and hopefully get better. This place, you, when you won last year here, is there something about this track that suits you? Well, I wish it was like the last two years. I mean, when it's slick to a cushion and you got to hustle your car, I really enjoyed it last year, and this year is more of a finesse, hit your marks, kind of like running pavement, and, um, and that's one thing I've, I've needed. I need to get more patience at and get better, and um, tonight I felt like I did that. Donnie actually got underneath me there for a second, and uh, I just kind of settled down and started hitting my marks, and I actually started running Jason back down, so it's definitely a learning experience, and it seems like every time you race with these guys, you should learn something. I feel like I learned a lot tonight and hopefully the next time we come to a track like this, I'm better.